Hello everyone, welcome to Captive Minecraft, and I've kind of restarted the map with my friends Core and Page of Maces, and we're gonna try and explore the multiplayer experience of this a little bit more, starting with punching this tree. <laughs> so prepare to get achievements, guys, because, yeah, it looks like we're all expanding the border at the same time. So do we all work within cool. the same world border? That's really I guess interesting. So. Because... Um. I thought the idea was that you kind of, you earn achievements together and you you kind of expand the map together, but I don't know if you if you each earn the same achievement when one person gets it. That kind of seems to be the case. So before we all make crafting benches, who wants to make the crafting bench? I think Core has all the wood, so I'm pretty sure it's just going to be oh, him. I've got one. Oh, you've got one. Okay. Um, yeah. Well, Core I probably has more at this point, so I'm going to start punching this tree for saplings. This is kind of like Skyblock when it starts out, like you've just got one tree and that's it. Okay, I'm gonna start making my crafting table. Sounds good, sounds good. I'll just stand here and look pretty. I'll yeah, be like see, Debbie McGee. See, we all get the... <laughs> Debbie McGee, you're gonna produce a, a, a bunch of flowers for uh, for Mr. Daniels. And yeah, oh. we... we uh, It's best not to I cut the quartz. In. Yeah. I got it. Yeah, it, it, it's best if you don't put stuff there because I think stuff appears there later on once you've... Uh, started earning ah. rewards um <laughs> the top of the tree is not gonna not gonna come down i'm trying to get saplings See. from the leaves i can reach but we will need to pillar up and get that in a second make some sticks sticks are always useful can't quite reach any of the chests yet so yeah i was expecting the border to expand <laughs> half a block for each person but it looks like it's just doing half a block at a time which is a little <laughs> bit frustrating but there you go just a little bit yeah not to worry. Time to strike. Got two achievements. Yeah, make it. And it looks like we can now open this. We've got a journal entry, which I can read for the folks at home. Day 18. I have finally reached the area marked on the map. Today will be spent setting up camp. Then tomorrow I can begin to dig downwards. So I think that's your cue to make a shovel. <laughs> I am the keeper of the pickaxe. There's also four raw pork chops, four raw beef. Eight gold nuggets and a leather tunic in there. So if anybody wants a leather tunic, you are welcome to it. I'm remembering from when I was watching, I think, Milby and Generic B do it when it first came out, that there's a load of stuff under here. Yes, there's definitely a room Correct. under there. I encountered that when I started my series. And I've got it's... a shovel. Where, where should I start digging? I'm going to wear the tunic. Um, you can give it to me because I've already started digging. Yes, yeah. Oh. Gather gather there snowballs and remake them into snow blocks just so we have some stuff to build with and we should be good. Um, I didn't gonna... get it. Who who got the shovel? I did not get the shovel. I still oh, have my is. pickaxe. I tossed it down there. So this is the world we've been given. <laughs> this is the hand we've been dealt. And I'm going to try and reach some more of this tree but yeah we don't have much grass to work with yet so I can't plant any saplings even if I get them I don't know if any saplings have fallen on either of you guys but I don't have one yet no nope. can we mulligan <laughs> let's have a do over shall we no I think we should be okay, good. Um, be okay. I've found torn journal entry yep and some more nuggets and some torches fantastic Here's some, apples and some apples and some nuggets Good stuff. Day 34, an avalanche has buried my escape route back to the surface. Without a shovel, I have no choice but to sit there underground until this winter is over and the ice starts melting. So Sounds that, like a plan. So that means the uh, <laughs> the room down there is going to be... Oh, let me see if I can place this chest to get that last bit of tree. <laughs> the room down there is very important. The room down there is the destination that this traveller who's left the journal entries has been searching for the whole time. You are slowly knocking me down the hole, though. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. That's the uh, 1.9 collisions for you. Well, I have found the Room of Monuments. And this place looks I see it. Yeah. absolutely amazing. I think the best thing to do would be to make ladders, and then we can put ladders on this kind of pillar of snow that I'm making in the middle, and we can hopefully get ourselves a nice little ladder going straight down into this room. And I'm making some snow blocks. Yeah, if you can chuck a couple of those down here, then I can complete the pillar. And then you guys can come down here and we can suss things out. Uh, that's weird. Did someone just shoot a spectral arrow? Oh. Oh. Nope. Uh, Ow. I, I am tripping then. There, there are 
definitely outlines down here. Yes. If if you come down here, you might see what we mean. <laughs> Welcome to the room of monuments. How's your frame rate? One. Yeah. <laughs> when <laughs> when I recorded this on my single player run through, mm. I was I was having a difficult time with this room. It's it's a little bit rough with the moving world border and the outlines. It kind of lags you out. So it may that be could best. Be to why it may be best to move out of this room at some point, but I'm going to start digging up the stone in the floor because this is how we're going to get cobblestone, you see. Ah, I'll just get all the snow. Yes, get all the snow, and if you've still got any wood on you and you can get up to build ladders, then ladders up and down are going to be the best way of getting in and out of this place. Okay. Get me away from these things. I think it might help if you go back up to the surface page, if you go with core and then work on um, getting us some more tools and stuff. Yep. Then that might be a good idea. Have some stone while you're at it. <laughs> That's if I can leave the room. I'll just stand on this gravel and farm flint. We got a sapling. Yes. Okay, replant that because <laughs> we'll need a source of wood. And some of the other trees are a little bit far off for my liking. I've already got a ton of stone, so I'm going to start making stone stuff for us all. Cool. Tree <laughs> has been replanted. That is an interesting staircase we've got going on there. <laughs> Ace. Right. Achievements inbound. Let's take a quick look at the tree to make sure I'm doing the right ones. Okay. To start us off with Hot Topic. Woot. And Woot. we may as well bring the crafting table and stuff down with us, although there are some chests up here on the surface that it's worth getting. And we can smash the grass while we're up here to get seeds, because mm. one of the achievements, of course, is baking bread. It's just bread. Even though there is no baking required. Yes. Yeah, always a bit of an odd one. Ooh. But, uh, yeah, if we take this chest with us as well, move the crafting stuff downstairs, and then wait for that tree to grow. Did we grab the torches out of this chest yet? No. Okay, cool. There's a couple there then. Right, I'll take those down here with me so we can light up this room. And we need to leave one of them upstairs by the water that's up there, by the ice, because then that will melt back into water and then we can use that to hydrate farmland and grow crops faster. Mm. Very right. clever. Put the uh, crafting table down for a second so that I can make us some stone tools. I can get out of here and actually do something rather than any just more, uh, here. Any more wood? Um, I'm actually okay for wood for now. The border is going to get expanded one more time. And I will throw you a pickaxe page so that you can one more? start mining out some of the stone. There you go. Get me out of here, man! <laughs> we need to work on ladders as well, but we'll probably be best doing that when the other tree has grown. Glad we got at least one sapling out of that tree. Please, sapling, grow. Make my monster grow. <laughs> <laughs> now that's a reference, folks. I'm that's not... going to be a reference that some of us are going to be too like. Some people are going to be too young for that, and that uh, makes me feel old. Yeah, boo. <laughs> I remember watching that in middle school. <laughs> yeah, when it was brand new. <laughs> Right, so stone tools. What else is next on the achievement tree? I'm just working on getting the border expanded as fast as possible. We can build ourselves a wooden hoe. Oh yeah, time to farm. Did we didn't get that one. I accidentally made a button. <laughs> well, we can use that later. There we go. More border to work with. That's what we like. There we go. A button hey. on the crafting table. That'll work. <laughs> to activate it, just in case. And I think the best thing to do with this is going to be to mine out all of the stone because presumably there's resources hidden under here somewhere. There'll be some iron or some coal. We might not be able to get to it yet, but in the meantime, once that tree grows, we can make charcoal with the wood. We can make more torches that way. I still have a couple in here, so we should be okay. Oh, there goes I my shovel. spotted some more outlines down here, so I've frozen again. <laughs> oh no. no. Not everyone has beefy computer setups. <laughs> I'm going to put the furnace down underneath the uh, snow pillar, which would seem like a bad move, but like full snow blocks don't actually melt, so we should be okay. I'm putting one beef steak in there and using my old wooden pickaxe to cook it, so if anybody gets hungry, 
help yourself to that. If anyone gets hungry, eat the charred pickaxe. <laughs> Got it. Nom, nom, nom. It's high in fiber. Yeah. In like, carbon. It's like barbecued. <laughs> uh, I see a creeper down here. Uh-oh. Yes. Uh, probably best not to engage. At least not yet. All <laughs> uh, right. I'm going to put the torch down next to the spruce tree so it can grow. See if there's any more grass I can reach. It doesn't look like there is. Well, I do have a wooden sword on me. I just made a stone sword if you want it. Ooh, it's dark down here. He's not seen me, so he's not aggroed. Yeah, probably best to leave him for the moment. Okay, well, I've just knocked him away from us. And that <laughs> would be... Cool, do you, still have... do you still have that hoe you made? Oh, I just yep. had an explosion. You okay, Paige? Yeah, I'm fine. Uh, Skelly just sh shot the guy and now he's shooting me. Yeah, I, be best to stay out of there until we can put together shields. Although there isn't any kind of penalty for respawning. It's not like the border shrinks again or anything. You do just... It's a standard Minecraft survival. You just lose your stuff and get returned to the spawn point. I know. But here we go. I'm actually able to hydrate farmland up here so if any of the zombies Ooh. drop potatoes or if we get some seeds from the grass out here as the border expands then we will be able to farm some wheat i'm really surprised we haven't got some uh, seeds from the grass already but that's the way the biscuit breaks <laughs> it is so the next things to do on the achievement tree are harvest some leather attack and destroy a monster eat a notch apple <laughs> catch and cook a fish or smelt an iron ingot so I'm thinking Monster Hunter is probably going to be the next best thing. Which means moving on down. I thought we were supposed to be I've moving on I've got the sword. I can up. try and kill a keep creeper with it. <laughs> Give it a try, Paige. Give it a try. Oh. Ah. <laughs> and that is um, what happens when you try to fight a creeper, ladies and gentlemen. Good job, though. I was right there. I saw it all. Oh, man. I saw <laughs> the whole thing. Sorry, Cora. I'm, I'm, I'm not trying to push you.